as an air traffic controller myself, I've heard from my fellow ATC friends stationed at New York International Airport about a certain section of the airport administration department in the new terminal building, where people have periodically witnessed disturbing and even downright frightening occurrences, leading many to believe the area is haunted. Some of the incidents, as shared with me, are as follows. Just a week before the grand opening of the new terminal in May 2008, a security guard from the Transportation Security Administration, TSA, was on his routine security rounds when he heard loud noises emanating from a restroom a few yards away. He cautiously advanced in that direction, with the noises escalating in intensity with each step, as if a heated altercation was taking place behind the restroom door. Just as he was about to round the corner, and see what was happening, the noises abruptly ceased, leaving an eerie silence. Despite being convinced that people were inside, he checked every stall, only to find the restroom empty. When he shared his experience with his colleagues, they brushed it off, assuming he had been drinking on duty. Fast forward to 2011, again in mid-May. Two custodial staff members, a man and a woman, were conducting their final cleaning rounds in a restroom when something horrifying occurred. As they were preparing to leave, they were shocked to witness all the faucets in the wash basin suddenly erupt, gushing water at full force, simultaneously. These faucets were motion sensor activated, and it was unusual for them to trigger simultaneously without any apparent reason. The custodial staff, terrified and baffled, couldn't fathom what had caused this phenomenon. The water display stopped after a few minutes, but just when they thought it was over, the same phenomenon occurred again, even more forcefully. The custodial staff fled the scene in fear. The following morning, the next shift of custodial workers found the restroom flooded and the sinks overflowing due to accumulated water on the floor. Despite explanations of plumbing malfunctions, many remained unconvinced. A more recent and unexplained incident occurred at the same New York International Airport, affecting a flight full of passengers. This incident took place in mid-May 2014, continuing the pattern of occurrences every three years. On a rainy night with moderate precipitation, an incoming flight for runway 27, specific details about the flight were unavailable, was approaching for landing during challenging weather conditions including unpredictable winds and rain. The foreign pilot noticed a figure, seemingly a person in white attire, possibly a dress or a gown, standing at the center of the runway. This figure was frantically waving its arms, almost as if signaling the pilot not to land there. Alarmed, the pilot initiated a go-around procedure, opting to abort the landing and make another attempt later. The pilot reported the incident to the air traffic control tower and security personnel were dispatched to investigate. Instead of finding a person, they discovered two dead dogs on the runway, suggesting a violent clash between them. If the pilot had attempted to land with the runway obstructed by the dog carcasses and the wet surface, a tragic accident could have occurred. Considering the recurring incidents every three years in mid-May, it might be inferred, on a somewhat light-hearted note, that New York International Airport might be considered safe from a paranormal or supernatural perspective until May 2017.